her how to practice. Maybe I'm letting you win. Oh, first time for everything. And I keep looking back. Cause you can hold her at night. But we both know you're so mine. We both know you're so mine. Where did you get these? Found them. Where? Around. You never were a very good liar. What makes you think I'm lying? These stones came from a lab. A lab? What are you talking about? Those belong to the council. You didn't just find them. You're sounding crazy. Give me the stone salon. These stones are worth a lot of money to me, Zareeb. This is the last time I'll ask nicely. How could you work for an organization that forces you to keep secrets from the people that you care about? You did. Yeah, but I left. Why won't you? What do they have on you? I'm taking the stones and you into the council. Why are you doing this? It's complicated. I told you she wouldn't come willingly. Glad to see you haven't let your feelings cloud your judgment or jeopardize the mission. I would never do that. I owe my life to the Counts. You were supposed to tell me when it got worse. I'm managing it. No, you're not. Let me see your hand. There's nothing to see. Really? We need to move faster. Fortunately, you've brought us an ideal candidate for the procedure. Wait, Salon? Did you really think it was only about the stones? How did you know she had them? Salon was always part of the plan. And you didn't bother telling me. We need to explore how someone else reacts to the blaze in order to reverse your side effects. Ever since she left us, Salon has needed money. You've been completely ignoring the urgency of the situation. I simply provided a bit of motivation for both of you. You set her up. I simply gave her a path to the money she needed. There must be another way. There isn't. To bring her to me. You're making a mistake. Are you questioning my judgment? No. Of course not. But what if she refuses? Then you'll have to terminate her. You're persuasive. Help her make the right decision. As you desire. Hear me out. I'm done listening to you. Please. Give me a good reason. I'm dying. Dying? You ask me why I stay with the council. They've been keeping me alive with those stones. Except they aren't real stones. They're synthetic creations called the Violet Blaze. They give me the power to manipulate and harness people's energy. Like I did with you. That sounds crazy. What does that make you? A superhero? That was the Council's original goal. They want an army of superhuman agents able to capture enemies with minimal casualties. So all of a sudden they care about humanity? Oh, but. I was able to neutralize people without killing them. For a while, things got bad for me pretty quickly. I got dizzy, started losing my balance. I'd black out for hours and wake up not knowing where I was. So the council forced you to do this? No. I volunteered. Why would you do that? I thought I could help make the world a more peaceful place. So you used this Violet Blaze power on me? It seemed to be working fine when you knocked me out. It's highly unstable. Well, why hasn't the council fixed it? Krell discovered that the stones were breaking down in my system after using my powers. The stones have been poisoning me. So that's why you left me. It was the only way to protect you. Protect me from what? Council threatened to kill anyone that I told. 
At least now I know I wasn't the reason you left. Not completely. What do you need me to do? Krell will implant stones into your fingers so we can figure out what's happening to me. And when we're done, they'll let me go? Yes, and compensate you well. I have a hard time buying that. You have my word. Okay. I'll help. I'll do it for you. Not the council. Thank you. Nice to see you again. Wish I could say the same. You know none of this is personal. Never has been with you, has it? I've chosen to separate my personal life from my work. It's less messy if you do. Whatever. Let's just get this over with before I change my mind. So is this gonna work? You should gain powers like Zari. We've made some adjustments to the stones, so they should be inert when not in use. You didn't answer my question. Everything's hypothetical at this point. So what if it doesn't work? And you lose the use of your hand. Fail to mention that. You didn't apologize for that giant scar you gave me on your last mission. That was an accident. Right. Complications are highly unlikely. Ow! Sorry. And you wonder why I left. Let's just do this before I change my mind. Wait. Use this one. Try again. Like this. What'd you need me for again? Ah. Concentrate. Closer, right? You're wasting time. This isn't a game. There's no room for error. Sorry. You're right. For once. It works. It works. We've taken samples from Salon and recreated the stones using the new Blaze formula. That's great news. Since we're able to stabilize you now, there's no reason to keep her alive. What? You didn't really think we were going to let her live, did you? But you promised. I gave her my word. Considering how badly she botched the last mission, do you really think we want her out in the world with powers? That was one mistake. One mistake that almost killed the both of us. Or have you forgotten that? She's too much of a distraction for you. She can be a powerful asset to us. Serve the council again. I'm going to make this simple, Zari. Either she dies or you do. You know you can't survive without our help. Maybe your feelings for her are more important than your own survival? No. Good. It's your choice. Actually, it isn't. Kill her. That's an order. As you desire. Change of plans, we need to go now. What's going on? She's still alive. And she's staying that way. <laughs> Help 
I'm not dying today. Good. We have stones to find. Together. <laughs> <laughs>